Today, an attempt to round up nearly two dozen people accused of trafficking drugs. Nets investigators summarized it led crews to Dayton and Vandalia in Montgomery County, as well as several locations in Greene County as well. And 2 News was there for all the action. Investigators out in full force in an effort to make your neighborhood safer. They all have uh, trafficked in drugs that we're looking for. Undercover purchases have been made over these from these people during the last 12 months. ACE led the attempt to serve 22 arrest warrants on Thursday. The drugs uh, primarily are heroin, ecstasy, cocaine, and methamphetamine. Take your time, watch your head when you get in. Two News was there during part of the two county search. Nothing in your pockets is going to stick me, right? No. Nope. That led investigators to more than just the people they were trying to find. Quantity of marijuana and cash in one place where a, a search warrant is now being drawn up to be executed at that house where we were seeking one of the uh, arrest warrants. Officials say the majority of the investigation stem from tips from citizens, and they encourage people to call them with any concerns. These are the people that draw the wrong type of uh, clientele into your neighborhood that end up committing thefts and everything because they're involved in drugs, they're purchasing drugs. One Greene County resident we spoke with was happy with the attempt to make the arrest. You know, if they're moving into abandoned houses and such, that uh, they need to go after those people and get them out of the city. And officials say they are always glad to help. This is something that we try to give back to the communities because of their service to us. In all six people were arrested today, the search continues for the remaining suspects.